Okay, now what I need to do is create configuration settings block. So I'm going to go into workspaces, managed, predefined. And since I already have things set up for me, I'm going to uh, create things in a demo mode. So the first one I want to create is a new configuration setting block. So I'm going to call this AECWS. The demo I'm adding just to move it. And the first setting I want to set is a variable. And I want to set underscore USTN underscore configuration. And I'm going to lock this. And what I want to do is pick a project-wise document or project-wise folder is what I'm pointing to. And that's going to, when I hit these three dots, it's going to pick a location on my network and or on my project wise and that location I want it to be this AEC WS folder. I'm not going to show that part because of security reasons but uh, you'll need to just set it to that folder hit OK a few times and then save that configuration settings block. Now that I have my AEC WS demo uh, work or predefined the next thing I need to do is set up a workspace and the workspace one is going to be a new configuration settings block and I'm going to call this one AEC uh, WS workspace for my workspaces and then I need to add underscore USTN underscore workspace name variable and that thing needs to be a string and what this is going to do is look for the parent uh, of the workspace so we're going to have to set up some rich or smart projects or uh, whatever you want to call them in project wise but it's the last dir piece of the DMS parent project for the DGNW dir so it's going to open up the file look for the last dir piece of the parent project and that's going to be the folder name so that ends up being the workspace name and I'm going to lock that and I'm going to hit OK then I need to add another variable and this one is called underscore u state or underscore USTN underscore workspaces root and that one is the parent dev dir of the file you're opening. So the parent dev dir of the DMS project dgender. And then I'm going to add one more. So I hit OK here. Oops, I forgot to lock that one. I also need to lock I need to lock all of these uh, then I need to add another variable and this one is called the USTN workspace root and I'm gonna lock it and then this one is the just the simply the DMS project or DMS parent project of DGender so it is gonna be the rich project the parent rich project uh, of the project of the where the file is located so once those three things are locked then I'm gonna hit OK and then I'm going to go back and find a work set and I'm gonna set a new one up here new configuration settings block and this one is my AEC WS work set demo And for this configuration, I'm going to add a new variable. And this one needs to set the workspace information. So this is the uStation work set name. And the uStation work set name is going to be the last dir piece of the DMS project. And so instead of the parent project, this one's just looking for the parent rich project of the file you're opening and I need to lock that and hit OK. Then the next variable I need to set is the uStation work set root. 
and I need to add a string for that. And this is the parent devder of the DMS project D of the file I'm opening, underscore dgender. And I forgot to lock that one. And then the third one I need to add in this area is the uStation work set root. And that one, again, I'm going to lock it, add the string, and this is just the DMS project of the file I'm opening. Once I have those settings all in place, I can hit OK and hit OK to this. Then I'm going to go to one more place up here in global, and I'm going to add an admin. So this one here is going to do a couple things for me. So I'm going to create a configuration settings block. So AEC WS admin demo. And this one I'm going to display all config vars because I like to see all of the variables when I'm going into the configuration and when I'm troubleshooting things. And I'm going to lock that and I'm going to add that one. And this one just needs a string of one to set it as active. And then I am going to do uStation work set DGNWS root. And the thing I want to do here is I want to set this to a location outside of project wise because managing the DGNWS files inside of project wise is kind of a pain. So I'm going to go back to my project folder. Uh, so remember we created a e projects dgnws folder to hold all of my dgn fi dgnws files uh, if i was moving just my work sets inside of on the network i can use that same folder and i'm going to place that string here and i probably should be looking at a a Windows or a directory instead of using that. So I'm going to hit that button and then I'll come back. So I pick directory and then I'm going to hit the value and go browse to it. Now we do need to make sure that the this file is readable by everybody so you could use a UNC path also but for me I'm just going to use my network location and I'm going to lock that so that it doesn't get changed and I'm going to hit OK. So now I'm done with ProjectWise Administrator and I can get out of it.